Hey everyone, Cowboy Sorrels here again, back with another review. Um, this review is going to be on uh, a two-part review. It's going to be a uh, chip review and a sandwich review. Um, I went down to the local subway and decided that I would try out another one of their sandwiches that they had there. And um, I saw that a few people have been doing reviews on the uh, the new flavor chips, I guess, for 2015. And so I figured I'd go down and try a small bag of them because they had them there at the subway I went to. And I noticed um, they had one called the, the West Coast Truffle Chips. And it looks like they have uh, flavored... Uh, Looks like some sort of a garnish of, um, I'm not exactly sure what that is, uh, but some sort of uh, green leaf type of um, stuff that you would find on french fries to give it some flavoring. Uh, these were submitted by Angie Fu, that was the flavor she came up with. Um, and it has a little bit of a story on the back here. It says, every time I see truffle fries on the menu, it is the first thing that I order. The ar aromatic flavor of truffle is worth is mouth-watering. Um, and this is one of their meat, one of our flavor finalists for Do Us a Flavor. And then they have vote at dousaflavor.com. I'll put the link in the description for you guys. So let's open this up and try it out. This is the first time I've had this, so I never, I don't know what I'll be, you know, what they'll be like. So let's try it out here. Small bag is good, just in case, you know, you don't want some big bag to try to get it or anything. Because you might end up having to throw it out. So. But let's see what what type of flavor we get out of these. I'm definitely smelling the, the rough, the, the lays. They are heavily coated. As you guys can see. So here we go. The first thing I noticed is that it has like a sour cream and onion flavor, so I think that's what they were. It definitely has that sour cream and onion taste to it. These are really good. I was skeptical at first because I wasn't sure what they were going to be like, but as soon as I started trying one, it definitely has a sour cream and onion taste to it. With a little bit of something else as well. So I would have to say... I would have to give the West Coast Truffle Fries, I would have to give them a B plus. They're really good. I really enjoy them. And like I said, they taste just like sour cream and onion. Um, I went, um, and I also have here, let me get the napkins out of the way. I also have a uh, uh, Veggie Delight as well. Um, I always like to have vegetables when it comes to sandwiches and stuff, so I went ahead and got a veggie delight as well with the chips, and then 
try that out. And this has everything except for the jalapenos, but I did have them put the banana peppers on it. I always like there to be a little bit of a spice to it. So, I'm going to open this up and I'm gonna try it out here as well. And for the dressing, I had them put just ranch dressing uh, with nothing else, just ranch and then salt and pepper. So there's not a whole lot on here, just a whole bunch of vegetables. And I've had them put it on nine grain honey oat bread, just to change it up a little bit as well. So this is the Veggie Delight uh, sandwich that I got from them. There we go. Wow, the bread just blends really well with this. All the vegetables everything just it's almost like a summertime dinner for every day something you'd want to eat during the summertime so yeah this is really good actually also it's not too spicy the vegetables and just a little bit of banana peppers on it give it that extra spice and then the ranch also gives it that extra flavor as well so I'd have to say for the veggie delight I would have to give it uh, an A so a B plus on the fries and an A on the sandwich uh, thank you all for watching uh, please stay tuned for more exciting product reviews. If you have any suggestions, leave them down in the comments below. And I'll make sure to get to them as quick as I can. Uh, thank you all for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And got a truck? Dirty it up.